Okay. Let's see. This says I'm on air. And I think it says, it says stop stream option, but hmm. according to this, I am offline. Yeah, it says it's online on my end, too. Um, hmm. Go back. It's the Elgato. Hmm. You know for a fact you click stream, right? Yeah, because if I click here again, it says stop stream. Stop streaming. Hmm. Here it says, it says, I'm on the air. What the fuck? That's really weird. Now it says it's live after refreshing. So it is streaming on your end. <coughs> oh, sorry. Yeah. Can you hear? Our, can you hear our voices? Or hear my voice? Yeah, I can hear our voices. All right. And this is. I guess the problem is, is my, it, so much lag on my computer for some reason that. Okay, yeah, it's just live on my thing now. Okay. But I guess that's a, I guess that's the thing. It, uh. Also, by the way, you haven't overlaid that has like pretty much nothing on it. Hey, you think it's okay to barge in? <laughs> and other than that, the stream isn't appearing to be lagging. It's not choppy. And it looks... Oh, okay, the layout's gone. Looks what? The layout's gone. I heard, I heard but, um, that part. Yeah. The, the stream seems to be, you know, pretty damn watchable. I haven't experienced lag yet. Alright. So that's good. There's no buffer. It's not choppy at all. So it looks like it's doing a good job so far. The problem, the problem, the problem is I just can't edit anything on my on my end over here. I can't, and that's where I would, and that's where I would need your help then. Like, the title or the yeah title description, description you know, and yeah. you know adding maybe a donation like, link thing for the GoFundMe page. Like trying to do it as like a, the part of the overlay, or just in the description. It's in the description. Or just edit the title, edit the see if you can add in donation things like like here. I see I have a donation thing, PayPal donation thing, but see if you can add a GoFundMe mm -hmm. uh, another link to this because I. At that point, yeah, I would need your account to adjust those things for you. Yeah. However. However, um, when I last uh, did that stuff, it wasn't really too hard, and I don't think it would be too hard still. I, I mean, the problem is, at least on my end, it, everything seems to be going very slow and lagging when I try, try to get on Twitch and stuff while doing things. When you're doing your own stream? What? When you're doing your own stream, it's all laggy? Yeah. I, I have no idea. Is this, is this the view? Is this, well, the viewer thing or my thing or what? Well, 
right now, I still have not had any buffering going on, and it hasn't been choppy at all, and it's still really watchable. Okay. It's like a normal stream quality right now, actually. Okay. So, so everything is going smoothly. Do you, do you know how to add links to here? Um... Since the last time I edited stuff for a description on Twitch, um, the last time I did that, the layout of everything was different. Uh, so I have to go on my own account and uh, see how it's like now. But once I figure it out, I can definitely help you with that. All right. Let me go on my channel right now. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, excuse me. And I think I'm gonna put these two pizzas of pizza in the in a baggie and put them in the fridge because I'm done eating them. So good. Oh wait, no, that's my channel, that's right. Oops. Alright, I'm back. Alright. Oh. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh, this is exactly the same way as it was the last time I did it. Oh, nice. Yeah, I, I could pretty much help you now. Oh, what is this, though? Channel feed. button the r3 button yeah 
Um, I think it's... Oh, you know the right stick? Yeah. You know how you can press it down and it clicks? That's the clicking at, is actually a button. So your con both control sticks uh, are also a button. So when it says R3, it means that you want to click into the right stick. L3 would be the left analog stick. Okay, so this is L3. So R R3 is the stick then. Yes. Okay. So they all, not only double as sticks, but they also double as buttons as well. Okay, I was wondering what that meant. Like, I see an R1 and R2, but I don't see an R3 button anywhere. What are they, like, yeah. what are they talking about? R1, R2, L1, L2, L3, R3. Not all controllers, however, use the stick as a button. For example, PS3 uses uh, the stick sticks as buttons, same thing for PS4, uh, PS2, and PS1, that, which they would go as DualShock 1, 2, 3, and 4. However, if you were to look at, let's say, a GameCube controller, yes, they will have sticks, but those sticks actually don't double as buttons because they don't click in. You'll know that they're buttons if they click in when pressed out on. <clears throat> so yeah, um, editing the title and the description is basically the same exact way as it was the last time I did it, like, a year or two or probably more ago, so I, I know what I'm doing. Okay. <laughs> Thankfully. And it's quite simple, too. Okay. I, so how do I add that link I sent you the down donation part? Alright, so you're on your channel right now, right? Yeah. So when you scroll down under your channel's uh, stream, uh, do you see the little thing for editing your, uh, your, your title and then a little bit down more right your here? description? Let me see. That's the edit button for the title. I thought that, that was that was up here. What's, what's this then? Uh, I'm not sure. I I didn't even see that actually. Let me see. Oh, that's for your avatar and cover image. Okay. But that's not that's not what we're gonna look at right now though. So. Um. So you see where it says edit panel to the left? Yeah. Okay, click that. Oh. And now you see that the, there's this little thing, right? The plus sign? So as you can... Yeah, if you click that, it'll add another panel. Okay. See, now you're able to uh, add your panel title, your, your image uh, links to, if you have an image. Okay. And you can see above that, between panel title and image links to, you'll see an add image button. And then, of course, you can add your description, like usual. Okay, hold on, let me see if I can... Yeah. 
Well, you're okay. There you go. Uh. Okay, I think I can... Okay. Hold on. I think I know what to do now for this part. This problem the picture was too big. You're not going to capitalize the H in help? I guess. <laughs> Gra grammar. <laughs> grammar much? <laughs> not grammar. Proofreading grammar much? Grammar Nazi much? And just and just as a test, you can click the image and see if it'll go to the link that's supposed to go to. All right, it works. Well, there you go. Cool, awesome. Simple, right? Yeah, when you when, when I when I when I'm... Someone commonly explains it, explains it, and I'm not stressed out. Everything is simple. Well, you don't think or you think? I think I'm, I'm not stressed out. It's simple. Oh. But that was helpful though, right? Yeah. Alright, just wanted to make sure. So yeah, now you know how to do it. Donate with PayPal, better equipment to make better quality streams. <laughs> okay, so.
and the stream and the stream itself is good. So, so this is doable yeah. then. Yeah, it is doable surprisingly. And can you still hear? Can you still hear my voice? Your voice on the stream? I'm not talking very well. Let me. S yeah. All right. Then. I yeah, think. I definitely hear it. Also, Elgato. I can use Elgato. I can do. I can do this stuff. Told you. Maybe the temperature uh, part might not be a problem. Maybe I don't need to take entire. I think what also contributed to what you being able to do this is your internet upgrade. Because better internet usually helps. <laughs> yeah. So I guess that little bar mo not moving from our voice doesn't mean anything if I, my voice is still coming in loud and clear. Personally, I wouldn't worry about it if it, it shows that it's being captured through uh, recording tests. Okay. Or, of course, listening at your own stream and seeing for yourself. Well, on your end, but it's captured fine, so it seems fine to me then. Yeah, and from what I'm looking at, it still has not buffered at all. Yeah, see, once you figure out everything and learn what stuff means, then it becomes pretty simple. So maybe tomorrow, I can, tomorrow I can actually do a real stream tomorrow. Yeah. Uh, there the time people watch me but wait to watch it. <laughs> now here's some other things to keep in mind too. On the chat end, um, you know, there's gonna... It, it's usually best to have chat interaction, so if you're able to view the chat and, you know, people ask you, like, certain questions or, you know, whatever, then... You know, you want to make sure that you are able to read it and then... I guess that's another thing that would ha that hopefully if you're watching it, watching the chat too, is... You would... Like, fil filtering out is what you're yeah, trying or, to say? Yeah, or tell, or tell me what the chat says so I can pay attention to the game. Yeah. Like, yeah you, 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 you can read the chat to me, I guess. Or you're... Uh, besides well, filtering too, obviously too, you know, but you can read the chat to me. That's chat. The chat's going on, and I can answer it without actually pausing and looking. Yeah. I will admit, it is kind of hard to pay attention to both at the same time, but. For me, it's not as bad unless it's like certain games where I need constant attention at the game itself. Because sometimes I, I'm here, I need to stand, you know, I'm doing it now, I, I need to stand up away from the computer. Yeah. To get a better look at the screen, mostly during boss fights and stuff. <laughs> and I usually have a one track mind about things. My focus, my focus is not focus on something else. Yeah. And so far, the te so far, oh, game. Yeah. A uh, twist to rise. So far, the gameplay test is ring. Okay. Yeah. Still has not buffered at all. I I remember how to do this. Yeah, last 
last time I played this game, I couldn't beat the final boss for Sora Story. I like, gave up on the game. Oh well. That's the. Oh, oh, you haven't got the final boss here yet, have you? Not even close. Oh. Is it a spoiler if I tell you what the, the boss does? The final boss? Yeah. I prefer not to know. Not, not the story wise, I meant, but the, how he interacts. Mm. For, well, for me, I'd personally rather not know. Okay, then. Then I'll wait till you. I'll wait till you get, get, to, get there eventually after, you, after you're done with your uh, press rate. <laughs> I keep calling it a race. You're 100%. It's gonna be a race in about 30 days, I'll tell you that. Just on the PS4 as a remake. I saw you hit that door with your keyblade. Sorry, but this isn't GBA. This is PS3. Oh yeah. I don't. I don't understand why they got rid of that though. Like, like why do you need to press the triangle button instead of just hitting the door with your keyblade? It seemed a lot cooler to hit it with your keyblade, not just <clears throat> with the triangle button. <laughs> Yeah, I'll need to do this stuff. I mean, I'm gonna, like I said before, once I, if I do, when I do the actual let's play, I'll, I'll do the cutscenes. But right now I'm just practicing how to play the game right now. Yeah, yeah, higher number beats lower number. God, the, the problem is, in this game especially, I get. I usually don't pay attention. I usually, I, I gotta. In this game especially, I gotta pay attention to this game because I usually just random. I usually just randomly attack things. Screw yeah. numbers! Like, go! Attack! <laughs> yeah. That's personally my problem with this game, is that the si the battle system is just kind of crap-ish. Oh, excuse me. I just realized you have 144 videos on your channel. My Twitch channel? Yeah. Yeah, because I, I said when I make a video, I, I highlight it and keep it archived so I don't lose it. Oh. Oh, yeah. And, and later I can upload it to YouTube if I, if I want to. So. Right. That's the thing, I can, up, I can upload a video to, to Twitch, then transfer it to YouTube, then I can tra there I can transfer it to VidMe if I wanted to. Like, so I have. Yeah. Twitch, the, the thing, the good thing about Twitch is that you have more control with the chat, like you can clear out chat if you wanted to, you could, you could slow down chat like you can do on YouTube, uh, you can do other things like if you were making money using Twitch and you had a subscriber thing, then you could change the chat to subscriber only mode where only people that are subscribed to you can post stuff in the chat. And of course, there's some other uh, things you could do. Like there's a thing called Nightbot, where it can do different things uh, with your chat. And in fact, um, if you really wanted it to, you could even uh, set it up so that it regulates the chat for you. Like for example, you could filter. I don't. Well, I'm not sure if Twitch does this uh, as a standard, but um, you can have the uh, Nightbot filter out certain keywords that you put in a list so like if someone used a certain word in their message then Nightbot would delete that message automatically so 
if you didn't really have anyone regulating the chat all the time, or if you had moderators but they're not on all the time, then uh, Nightbot could just, you know, be the bot and just do what you tell it to, pretty much. And plus, um, you could even do certain other things, like, uh, there's a thing you could do with Nightbot where, uh, if someone were to put in a certain command with a YouTube link or a SoundCloud link, um, that would be a thing called requesting music, and if you have it set up properly, you can allow people to request songs and then have it play on the stream. Though, you'd, if you had it set up, you would have to be careful because people could potentially exploit that. I've had that one time when I was using Twitch uh, a couple years back. I've had people constantly abuse the crap out of it by purposely putting in, uh, like, songs like John Cena, but it would be like ear rape version. So Yeah. It it was a it was not a pretty sight. And I per like if I was streaming on Twitch, I personally wouldn't use that anymore because if you uploaded it on YouTube you get a lot a lot of claims. I never gotten a strike for having Twitch streams on my channel that I used the custom music thing for. I've never gotten a strike or anything like that, but you will get a lot of claims. Like, notifications on your email, and it's like, well, not a lot, like one email, but it'll list a bunch of things. And it's like, oh, fuck. Or actually, no, maybe you do get a bunch of stuff on email, I don't remember. I guess, but... I guess that's the one thing about I, for when I make the actual Let's Play on thing, I can edit out the stupid copyrighted songs and stuff. Well, I mean, mm, the only problem with sure. this, this this game I, I is mean, I, I want to it's it's this stupid music that's copyright all, all the time. I mean, if you were to edit it out, then you know, there's not really much else you could do with it. I mean, I, I mean, I mean, you could you could mute it, I guess. <laughs> but the problem, but the problem is, if you were to edit out all the parts where there's custom music, and let's say, let's just say that people regularly <coughs> requested songs, then pretty much that would translate to the entire stream. Well, I'm not, I'm not gonna play music on my stream. I guess I could, I guess, but uh, well, I, well, I know, but I'm just saying, like, that's something that. Well, well I meant mainly when... on YouTube when you play the theme part of this song, open it, any credits, it gets the whole stream gets muted. The whole video gets yeah. muted. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. When I'm, you know, that's yeah, fun. that's. But yeah, that's something you could do if you really chose to. And that's kind of the cool thing with Twitch chat, YouTube chat. I think you can use Nightbot on YouTube chat, but in terms of like clearing the chat, like you can on the Twitch chat. Um, that's basically impossible, and there is not, it's not even an option on YouTube chat, which is really stupid. It makes no sense as to why it's not even a feature on YouTube chat. I mean, it, it seemed like it would be a simple thing to add, but apparently not, not to YouTube. Ooh. So personally, I just found a stream on, on you guys are available to help me keep an eye on chat. So I, that's why I made you moderate in the first place. Yeah. Though, personally, I think I'd be the one most active, because, well, Brandon's working at Schnick, uh, I don't know what he does, and then me, I basically do next to nothing all day, so. Yeah. <laughs> I pretty much sleep all day. <laughs> yeah? Yeah, I, 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 so... I did change my schedule a little bit. I'm gonna be if it works. I'm, I'm gonna be off on Mondays and Tuesdays instead of Tuesdays and Wednesdays. Hmm. Uh, I get, I probably could get some more HP eventually, but I also need. Oh god, this is the problem. Uh, later on, we need some help surviving and stuff, but. Yeah. I also, the pro 
also more cards to be, uh, be helpful. Yes, go, go, go for it. You know, I never, I never could imagine myself working at a McDonald's, especially if I was doing like cooking in the kitchen because. The cheese, man. Oh my god. I The cheese looks disgusting. Like, that's just the truth, man. It doesn't even look like cheese. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's like, I like when I was eating that burger one time, it was just like, oh, this is kind of odd tasting. I mean, it didn't taste like... I mean, it tasted fine, but at the same time, there was, like, something that didn't seem quite right about it. And then I opened the bun, and the fucking cheese was not even with the bun. It just came right off, and the cheese... Oh, my God. I don't know how to describe it, but it was, like, all bubbly. It was really thin for some reason, and... It just did not look like cheese, and especially considering that uh, the cheese didn't even uh, stick to the top bun. No, it just came right the fuck off. So, and looking at it pretty much made me want to puke. I just straight up could not eat it at that point. So yeah, cooking in the kitchen at McDonald's, I don't see myself doing that at all. <laughs> Skip. So how do you think you're doing with streaming so far? I guess it's good. It's streaming fine. And my problem is, my problem has always been at this point, is that the not get stream working. My problem is the talking part. <laughs> oh, the commentary. Yeah. Hmm. Just keep the conversation going. Plus, yeah, even, plus it's... Even I'm talking about myself. That's the hardest part. Yeah, it's not really a thing that you could explain very easily. Sometimes I get so caught up in the game that I forget to talk. Oh yeah. Yeah. Huh. I guess it was why I like doing the co-op stuff because the other people you know keep, can talk to you, keep conversation going. But the problem I, I, I'm finding out is when I do it with more than two people, like all four of us, it's the randomness, chaos. That <laughs> so, like, if it gets up to four people, then it just becomes ridiculous. Sometimes, you know, pan the four people, I guess. Would you say that happens in the podcast as well? Some... It's more... More a lot less when you, when you guys are playing... Trying to multitask and stuff. When you explain a game, not paying attention, or Ben's playing a game, not paying attention to the podcast, you know, and... <laughs> yeah, I... I tried doing that before, but I could never do it because, well, personally, I like to have sound on my game, you know? Like, I don't really like to play having it mute all the time. Yeah. So, that's my problem, and... I mean, now, I just don't really see much point. I mean, if Schneck wants to do it, that's fine, but, you know... I mean, it seems like... It seems like he pays attention for the most part and also explaining, but that might be because I usually see him, you know, at the college or, you know. Yeah. Or maybe I just don't pick up on it. 
And I don't know. I don't it's, know. It's what it's, Brandon, it's more not the podcast. More, it's more of a uh, gameplay, I guess. Let's. I like casual talk. No, I mean, but when I try to do a game before a let's play, um, it's like Stig was playing a different game, you know, while I was streaming, while I was recording this game, like say this game, and then uh, just. Hmm. So he wouldn't pay attention, basically. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, cause it, yeah. I guess the thing is, you're at least in my. Me helpful thing. Yeah, I can't. I can't know what I'm saying. Like he was, he, he was focused on his, on his game, and the helping me keep the commentary on, on on the game I was playing or recording. Yeah. So, that's, that's, that's that's what usually when I. For the most part, when I in the let's play of other people, I I focus on, on the, the screen. It's like like, like I, cause usually I'm because usually I'm, I'm the guide master on games like this. Yeah. For you guys, so I have to pay attention. <laughs> hmm. So do you think he doesn't pay attention whenever you ask him specific questions, or just in general? I'm not sure. I haven't done like, it in a while. I, like like if you're. Oh, okay. I mean, if it's a thing where it happens most of the time, then that might be a problem, but... I don't know. I haven't really... I don't really know what it would be like. Last time I did that kind of thing, I don't remember it. I don't remember me having too much problem, but again, I probably just didn't pick up on it, or maybe I don't remember something, or, or maybe I don't I'm know. just too too picky about stuff. <laughs> mm, I can't really tell you because I don't know what it was like, so. Again, I'm not saying. So what I'm doing on the screen, I'm just like, hit X button, go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And, uh, I I I'm bad at this at this game in particular because I, this game called strategy. Use strategy, and I'm bad at that. I find it really annoying when I'm trying to attack an enemy and I just spam the X button, and all of a sudden, like. After like two seconds of spamming the button, I realized that my cards are all being blocked. I find that very annoying. And that's kind of why I hate the system in this game, because it's just really annoying to deal with. Especially certain rules like, oh, if you combine three cards, and they don't make a special move, then the first card in the combination, or in the stack, is uh, gonna get go out of the battle completely. And then it'll come back uh, after the battle, but it's like that, the fa that fact alone is very annoying. I can deal with all three cards going away if you're using a special move. I have no problem with that, but the first card going away, that's why I have a problem with, if it's not a special move. I mean, it's, it's, not, it's no problem when you're like in a regular battle where you battle over soon, but if you're like, like in a boss battle, that could be a really that could be a real issue. Yeah, especially since that there's no retry button be, or there's like no regulation in the game to tell, hey, you made this boss battle basically impossible. Would you like to retry? It, no, it doesn't do that. It's like. No, fuck you. You're you're either gonna beat this thing or you're gonna die. That's how it's gonna go. Like your trick master thing. Yeah. Like at, at some point, I real like I had three cards: one attack, one heal, and one Simba card. And eventually, I just realized this is this is now impossible. Uh, I can't restart, so I might as well go up to this wall and just have him kill me and even the 
freaking Trick Master couldn't kill me when I was against the wall. I mean, he could, but he didn't do it so easily as I thought. He had a hard time, and I was standing in one place. I was even jumping around, and he couldn't hit me that easily at all. And I was kind of shocked, actually. Boss. Nice. Well, we'll have to get him, but I hope I can beat it. <laughs> if I can't beat him again, well, I definitely can't beat him on Proud Mode. You can't beat him on Proud Mode, huh? No, if I can't, as I said, if I can't beat even the be, be him on Beginner Mode, then I definitely can't well, beat him on Proud Mode. Hmm. Right? Kind of like what sense there. Yeah. So far I could be in our beginner mode. I have never this I I I've never played any game on proud mode yet, so let alone critical mode. So what I finally do is gonna be a, it could be a fun, fun challenge. Yeah. I wouldn't say the first boss is uh the most worrying thing in the run, but, um, you know, Trick Master might be a little bit of a pain in the ass, though I noticed that if you have the table up and you're constantly attacking it, uh, the boss will get staggered a lot. Yeah. Usually, I found out the- it, did, did you go to, uh, Mastro first before you went to Trick Master? No, I went to, well, you know, I went to- uh, Travers Town, and then after that, I went to Wonderland. Okay, because is it there's a cheat you, you, you can you go to if you go, if you go to Monstro, you get high jump. Like, like, in, like in the hmm. KS1 game. Huh, that's kind of nice. And the high jump. It's small detail too, huh? Yeah, you, you don't. It's like you, you can don't need the table, I guess. You can just high jump up there to get to him. Yeah. Same thing with uh, second round. Second round cards. Yeah, you, you, you have the glide option in Neverland. Let's let you. Why other things we need, need to? Yeah. But, so I guess, I guess that's the thing. Boss fight number two. Coming at ya.
to get the power below. Very goofy. You can kill him. Gosh, you think they're more like Axel and, and the other guy? If you meet Axel again, you can leave him to me. Sure, Donald. Sure. I'll <laughs> leave him to you. Because you are so useful. Same. You know. Wonderful, wonderful wonderland. Yeah. I like the vines. 
Let's see if I can find it. I have money I have.
Okay. Okay, I think, I think that seems easy enough. Yeah, I bought, I bought this pot. They shot. I was trying to buy basically about three packs of cards. Then I sold off all my kingdom cards that I bought because they're useless and put all my not kingdom cards in my deck. Hopefully, not, not, hopefully not on a stronger deck. Hmm. Which hoping at least. I heard getting your CP up is more important than your HP up. Yeah. My red. I guess. Um. For me personally, I guess both is useful. Maybe CP is better. But H HP would probably come in second most important. Yeah. Well. And it also said whenever you can to get your slaves, because you only get them once you only get them once every three levels, and I mean, I mean, like, like, what do you mean? Like, if it says that there's a slate available, yeah, and you go to level up something else, then the next level up it disappears from that option, and you can't select the slate anymore. I think so. Mm, no, it appeared that if I didn't select it. It just stays like that until you select it, I guess. I think what it was saying is that every three levels that you are able to get a new slate. But it, that doesn't mean that if you select something else instead of the slate, then you have to wait another three levels, so you should be fine there.
god. Oh well. This. this is what I can't be doing on a let's play. What's up? What? What'd you say? This is what I can do on a let's play, not talking at all. Oh. I'm sorry, I don't really have anything to talk about right now. Yeah. It's a good thing, it? And, uh oh. I could do post commentary, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. Like I said, the lock the thing I did, but I don't know. Just, uh, I thought I'll, I'll just beat this boss here and turn it off. Cause I, I think the practice run, I think the practice run did good. I mean, how? Is your game going so far? So far, so, so far it's good. I'm, it's, it's like I'm surviving because I'm on death, but I got the yeah. gameplay down, I guess. It's, if I if I should, you know, like yeah. Yeah. Do, use more strategies I'm using. Huh. Yeah. But that's comes with. I don't have to play the game actually. They're just randomly hitting the X button like I'm doing right now. Huh. I hope it all works out. I guess it had CP points as the. be able to hold more cards so I, I randomly attack the X button. Uh -oh. I'll have more attention to the painting if I have uh, three little cards. Remember to pay attention.
da, 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 da. Talking, talking, something talking. Da, 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 da. It gets hard. Surf save first. Surf save first. Hindsight. Always hindsight in this game. Here we go. The Trick Master. Let's see. Do I get what to say? Yeah. <laughs> 
big key is here, it's gonna take my time. Gotta be the key to here. Just gotta, gotta take my time and do some regular fights. I get more cards, but. Then, um. A regular fight, a boss fight, to get on the option, I guess. I gotta. I gotta. React fast and use strategy. Stra strategy. Yeah, that's a really, really uh, good thing. No idea that I'll just to capture up or not. Because, yeah. This is not moving, so I have no idea if it's moving or not. Give me a Skip the event, skip the event, because I do not care right now. I mean, I care about the story, obviously, but I am here. Ooh. Ah. Get gameplay down. This is why I'm terrible at these things. I have nothing to say. In fact, I have the only thing I can say is I have nothing to say. I have nothing to say at all. Just... Just talking for talking, I guess, is a thing, I guess.
Yes, I don't know where to go here. Just to take it. Guys, gotta know that the optimal CP is good. I can spam slays. Alright. Blah 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 blah. Write the journal. No. I don't know. That bug is. Is evil. Skip event. Skip event. Friends. Ah, right, well, right, attachment is good, I guess. So, I don't know the name. Oh, is it means capture still? Just hope it is, but. Well, if not, you can't hear me. I'm just ending it now. Hope you all enjoyed it. Stream. Donate the money to the GoFundMe page. Alright. See ya.